Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise 4E channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. On March 5, Robert Carrison Brown, 25, was found dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound by his younger brother Gabe, 22. Christine, 51, shared a slideshow on Instagram featuring some of her final images of Garrison prior to his passing. Nearly two dozen Sister Wise stars were seen grinning together in one root photo. Another captured Garrison appearing animated during a family gathering while wearing a patterned t-shirt. He was seen lounging on a sofa in other pictures, wearing a yellow t-shirt and posing with his sister, Savannah Brown. Every photo with Garrison in it is now infinitely more important than ever before, the post caption read. I am scrambling for just another glimpse of such an incredible man, brother, son, hashtag always be missed, hashtag miss you, hashtag note now. Love letters for Christine and the Browns poured into the comments area from fans. You and Janelle are the best moms and Garrison loved you so dearly. We all adore Garrison like he was one of our own, I appreciate you sharing and will continue to pray for you all, one remark said. A lovely child, Garrison, rest in peace, another person wrote. Really, really sad. My prayers are with all of you, penned a third. Despite their disagreements, Kobe Brown went to his son Garrison's house right away following his tragic demise, as the US son exclusively disclosed earlier. Despite their distance from one another, Cody, 55, was en route to the location on March 5. The second family member to come on the scene following Gabe was 54-year-old Janelle. According to paperwork she signed after giving her statement to the police, Gabe left the scene to pick up his father and return with him to the apartment. The police report that the U.S. son was able to obtain contains no further mention of Cody. Fans of Sister Wise knew that Garrison and Cody had a turbulent relationship for years prior to his passing. A source previously told the U.S. son they were still estranged and sadly never made up before Garrison died. I don't think they had even spoken since COVID times. According to the family source, I can say with certainty that there was no buddy hangout or camaraderie. To be honest, I have no idea when they last saw one another. From what I know, the last time they really had an interaction was when they met up and had a big argument on camera. During season 18 of Sister Wise, Garrison and his younger brother, 22-year-old Gabe, talked about their difficult relationship with their father, Cody, and his former wife, Robin Brown. The breakdown happened during the COVID epidemic, when the father had imposed stringent regulations out of concern that he and his younger children would contract the illness. The U.S. son was informed by a source that Cody pushed his family away for a very long time. These two guys have been the ones causing the most suffering. The U.S. son stated in October of that year that Gabe and Garrison weren't stepping down following their major altercation with their father and wanted nothing to do with Robin, the villain. Following the boy's declaration that they were done with their father and stepmother, an insider said, they're letting it be and just supporting Janelle. On March 5, Janelle came to Garrison's house to grieve the loss of her son. Janelle stated in the affidavits that he just stopped texting last night. According to the report, Janelle also made the comment that she should have gotten Garrison help in the past as well. Furthermore, Garrison was described by Janelle as being estranged from his father. According to Gabe, Garrison had been struggling with mental health concerns and alcohol abuse, he told the authorities as much. You can chat on 988lifeline.org, text crisis text line at 741,741, or contact the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 800 to 273 tail K 8255, if you or someone you know is touched by any of the topics discussed in this story. On Tuesday morning, Gabe, Robert Carrison Brown's younger brother discovered the 25-year-old man dead from a gunshot wound that he had self-inflicted. 
The police record that was exclusively obtained by the U.S. Sun describes Janelle's arrival on March 5th. The filings state that Janelle said, he just stopped texting last night. According to the report, Janelle also made the comment that she should have gotten Garrison help in the past as well. Furthermore, Garrison was described by Janelle as being estranged from his father. Fans of Sister Wives were aware that Garrison and his father, 55-year-old Cody Brown, had a turbulent relationship for many years before to his passing. According to Gabe, Garrison had been struggling with mental health concerns and alcohol abuse. He told the authorities as much. Garrison's roommates Tyler, Cheyenne and Addison provided their stories of the events leading up to the tragedy on Monday night in the police report. The officer noted in his letter, Addison said he's talked to Garrison about his recent depression. He stated that Garrison is an alcoholic and drinks every night. The night before Garrison committed suicide, Addison claimed they had a conversation in which Garrison seemed to be intoxicated. Addison claimed that despite their extensive time together, nothing Garrison said ever sparked a red flag. Addison said that he knew that Garrison was having problems with his ex-girlfriend and that he was not a very happy person, the report continued. Cheyenne, Garrison's other roommate, confirmed Addison's account of the reality star's hardships. She said that she had been speaking with the Sister Wise star more frequently lately, despite the fact that they had only ever met in passing. She stated that she talked a little more in-depth with him about how he was struggling with drinking and his depression surrounding that. The statement from the police continued. Concerns about Garrison's welfare were raised by his last texts the day before the terrible event. The TV star told authorities that she'd have found troubling communications from her son sent just prior to the incident, Janelle claimed that Garrison had texted a group of persons that collaborate with the Brown family on their TLC program. I want to despise you for sharing the happy times, according to the message. However, I am unable to. I long for these bygone days. She informed authorities that she contacted her son after discovering Garrison's odd text, but he only responded for a short while before stopping. Gabe offered to have someone check on him, after she called her other children. Garrison was already dead when Gabe got to Flagstaff. The U.S. Sun recently learned from an insider that TLC cameras will be recording the aftermath of the National Guard veteran's suicide despite objections from fans. The family, which includes Cody, Janelle, Robin, Christine and Mary, is usually always filming. Whether it's with real cameras or on their phones, the source revealed. As sad as it is, his unexpected death came during the timeline of filming. The insider asserts that because Garrison's appearance on the show, his tense relationship with Cody was widely reported during the previous season, and since viewers embraced him, TLC is going to want to continue the storyline and fans are going to expect to know what happened to him. The person went on, It's hard to believe none of this will be captured on camera. I just don't know how far this will go and how deep the family will get. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.